I'm gonna drop seven points of vampirism so I can get that. Damn worm. I can't hit it either. It's dangerous. But at the rate I'm healing, can't be too dangerous. Alright, so what did I get? No, I'll take it. Let's swap that out. And it tempts me. I nah, will stay vampire. Vampire's the way. Now I'm just sitting on stuff. This guy killed me before. That guy? <laughs> I fought him on a level 24 loop. He just smacked me around. <laughs> I was like, okay, you're done. <laughs> I was like, alright, I guess I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> skeletons don't miss about. <laughs> really, for real. He was like the only one too. Every other skeleton I fought, they were like, all right, we'll see how far. Maybe I might even break into the 30s. And then I saw that guy and he was like, nah, bro. <laughs> you got to get some upgrades. I was like, cool. I guess I got to get upgrades now. <laughs> well, we'll see. 24 is my personal best. Maybe we can get higher. 25, it's a victory. One day I'll even fight the Lich, I swear. <laughs> Ooh, level 9. That attack speed, though. Do I want it? For like two more points of damage. Damage to all, though. You know, yeah, I am. The healing is real. Ooh, and I got another ability. Uh, okay. Defense is increased by one after every loop. I've made it to 20. 20 loops. Damage is increased by 20% of defense value. Hmm. Huh. You know, I haven't tried this. Let's try skilled armor. <clears throat> Let's put some faith in the defense. Even though I know offense. <laughs> offense is always the answer. That's why that looked weird. I was like... Gotta watch out. The Lich is fast approaching. Okay. No! But of fingers, it cost me. Cost me everything. Yeah, I don't do sushi, but I had snake once. That was good. Oh, cool. Uh, yeah, I've had a snake hot dog before. That was pretty tasty. There was this, um... <laughs> I was about to say the stupidest thing ever in my life. I was about to say there was... <laughs> oh, man. I, at this point, I'm tempted not to, not to say it. Snake hot dog sounds super strange. Yeah. It was a rattlesnake, pretty much just sausaged. With some jalapeno, some sauerkraut, uh, jalapeno cheddar bun. That was actually really good. First time I've ever had snake, and I had it in hot dog form. <laughs> but to incriminate myself, or 
<laughs> to show you guys how unintelligent I am. I was gonna say, I don't know why I was gonna say this, but it just popped into my head. I was gonna say at a wiener dispensary. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a it's a like a a sausage um yeah shish kebab ooh cool that's like camping food like you caught your rattlesnake and then you ate it teach the other rattlesnakes not to mess with you but i went to like uh there was this restaurant um hole in the wall they basically they just do nothing but like their own sausages like they got Snake, I need a wiener dispensary in my life. <laughs> Perfect. <clears throat> I was too hard on myself. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why it like it popped into my mind that way, but that's like all they do is they specialize in hot dogs and sausages and they make their own. Um, they're really like gourmet. Um, they get like rabbit, rattlesnake. They got a bunch of other gamey type animals in hot dog form. It was really good. They're really good on the portion. Always packed. We would always go there like at one in the morning because they were open pretty late. Sell alcohol too. Pretty good indoor dining. <laughs> God, my friends are amazing. We literally went there just for the hot dogs. The new sausage shop name. We nerd is fancy. You heard it here, folks. <laughs> Kiwi knows the name of the place. She's been there. <laughs> we went there. We ate. We ate the exotic hot dogs. And then we, before we leave, my friend, there's like literally just a hot dog peddler on the side, like on the on the sidewalk. <laughs> That friend's so awesome, he's like, eh, might as well. He bought another hot dog. <laughs> from, <laughs> from the sausage peddler. <laughs> and he asked me if I wanted one too. I felt like saying yes. And then I got flashbacks of the golden tiger rolls. And I was like, oh no. I learned my lesson. <laughs> I'll just... <laughs> I'll, put, I'll keep my greed in check. <laughs> But yeah, my friends got them Saiyan diets. I don't know. I don't know what it is. I used to have a Saiyan diet, but I must be slipping in my old age. <clears throat> I'll wait till I get to level nine. <laughs> we have to make this a thing, though. Wiener dispensaries. <laughs> We'll cater to the masses. Ooh, a level 10. Yes. Oh, hell yeah, that's way more regen. That's exactly what I have. Just ever so slightly worse, but better. Take it. So much regen. Oh, yeah. I haven't, I haven't even showed you my master plan. Hold on, hold on. I gotta use this bad boy. We're, we're in loop 10, so we're getting there. We're getting there. Look at my health. Full health? Not even a problem. And the only thing that can kill me now is the ghost of that one guy that hates me. If I meet the skeleton, he's like, sorry, bro. You're not being in the game tonight. Alright. All you need is one of those shirts. Shoots from games and modify for that. <laughs> that would be awesome. Not gonna lie. Alright. I want to use one more of these things, but I'm terrified about where I want to use it. Here, I suppose. Actually, no, that's, that'd be a waste. Or would it? Now, nah, leave it there. Do I want to get extra greedy? Running out of material. My bar. I don't even think I've ever used these potions. And. 
And hopefully I never have to. I will do this. Bam. I still gotta finish these off. I'll wait though. Potions get used automatically. Oh, that's right. That's right. Thank you for reminding me, Blushed. Uh, uh, sunrise. Blushing Sunrise. Gotta remember. I gotta remember how this game is played. Alright. Evasion 17. But damage to all. But that high ass evasion. I'll do it. The regen, when you're like 30% vampire. <laughs> it's off the charts. <laughs> we'll see if anything can kill me. I'm lucky I'll get one of these bumped up next. Oh, they're doing damage. I was under 12 for like a second. <laughs> oh, speaking of 12. A lot of HP. Oh, hell no. I gotta, I gotta, I have to stay a certain percent vampire for this to work. Oh, that's beautiful. I'm back to full health. They literally can't kill me. <laughs> I'm like Deadpool. I just keep coming back. Wow. I got hit. <laughs> I just go back to full health. Amazing. Ooh, level 10. Alright, that does mess with the build. I'd get a nice chunk of HP. Damn, I dropped 13% vampire. Hmm, I'd still have what? Eight? No, 10%? 23% vampire? Hmm. This is the only way I'm gonna increase my HP from here on out. Unless I add more rocks. That would make more goblins. <laughs> Vampire for the win. Oh, hell yeah. We're gonna get it. Oh, there we go. We can... Why not both? So, 10, 11, okay. 21%. I dropped 2%. But we're still... We're still... I can live with that. We're gonna go the distance. Damn. <laughs> I almost one-shot that harpy. I just need a really good shield. Oop, or get tempted by this ring. Mm. Nope. Not good enough. Ah, but the shield. Oh, look at that! More percent vampire? Perfect. Steadily. With every piece of equipment I get, I become more vampire. I'm unstoppable, look at that. <laughs> the only- Wow! I literally- I can't be hurt. I mean, I'm getting hurt, but at this rate, is it really damaged? I walk it off like it's nothing. At this point, all those villages are just overkill. <laughs> when you're more vampire than the vampires themselves. <laughs> oh, cute. You're healing by one. <laughs> let me let me show you how to properly vampire. <laughs> Damn, they really can't. 
I'm a, I'm a vamp. I'm an, I'm a vampire god. <laughs> Abyssal Lich coming in with that 100 bit chair. I appreciate it. <clears throat> we got a big bit chair in the stream, everybody. Thank you, Abyssal Lich. The vampirism is the answer. <laughs> Out vampires a vampire. It's working, it's working. Ooh. The regen. Why have 3.6 regen when I can just become 32% vampire? <laughs> oh, oh my god. I'd keep the regen. 3.6 is a lot. That is a lot. But I can, but I can become, now hear me out, but I can become, let's see, if I put that on, that's four more percent, I'd be, it's okay, so that's 25, oh, the ring has a little region too, oh, it does, 1.8, I, I, so it'd be 25, Thirty-six percent. I'd be thirty-six percent vampire. More vampire than the other vampires. I think I'll go for it. It does. It does have a little slight regen. I think. What was this one? My blade. I can live with one point eight. There we go. Now I'm roughly thirty percent vampire. Again, we're going the distance. So far, I, I can't be killed. <laughs> I've become a god. <laughs> I've become a regeneration god. Damn. Even with a one point. Even with a one point of regen, I'm still at full health. <laughs> Everything's like, stop. It's not fun fighting him. <laughs> he just... <laughs> He takes the hits and he walks them off. And then he comes back the next day to do it again. <laughs> More power. <laughs> I mean I I should. I gotta I gotta start diversifying. I have a little bit of bar left. I gotta use it. I'm thinking that at insult to injury. I'll put some hotels here. Our villages. I'm thinking Monopoly. <laughs> um, our, maybe here. Our, maybe even get a little, a little crazy and add a, a few more enemies. I don't know. We, we, I have options. That's what I'm trying to say. Let me take a look at this ring. Hmm. I'll hold on to that. But this 12, though. Hmm. I'll hold out. There's got to be a way to get regen and vampire on the ring. That could be more vampire. Look at that. That healing is just overkill. So much overkill. <laughs> I hit like a truck, I take damage like a truck, and then I just... It's like nothing happened. It's like, ah, It is nothing but a flesh wound. <laughs> Alright, this has to really tempt me. 71 max damage? I think I'll wait. Who needs potions? I just walk it off. <laughs> the villages heal me. Exquisite mirror. Ooh. I'm just rolling in good stuff. I'm not even using it. <laughs> Alright. 
Can I be tempted? Ooh, my armor. The last piece of vampire. Everything has vampire. Vampire, vampire. Oh. My health would go down, but I, I'd become 40% vampire at this point. Mega vamp. Do I do it? Do I do it stream? Do I become 40% vampire at a loss of, what, nearly 30? 39? Definitely. <laughs> there we go. We're about 40%. A little bit higher than 40% vampire right now. <laughs> this is the most vampire I've ever been. Now we gotta write it out. We go all the way to the moon! <laughs> like the Joker once said, I'm thinking aggressive expansion. <laughs> I was gonna look out for the bigger, better deal. Okay. Behold the power of Mega Vamp. <laughs> Damn, the little slime that could. He took a beating. <laughs> This is what the Lich must feel like when he fights me. <laughs> Except he doesn't heal. He just hits me <laughs> until I die. And then I'm like, okay. I'll see you next week, Blister Lich. <laughs> oh, there's three of these things now. Their numbers are increasing. <laughs> oh, level 15 gear. Hmm, 16% vampire, you say? Now I'm like 40, oh, I'm like 45% vampire. I'm so close to being 50%. Oh, hell yeah. And it's a massive increase to health. That's 27. 37. Oh, 47. No, I am 50% vampire. Altogether? Let me redo the math. Yeah, 27, 30, no, 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 37. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. 52% vampire. I may be off. I was never good with the math. <laughs> it shows your vampire percentage at the bottom. Oh, it does! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I didn't. I. Oh, yeah. The stats. I never look at my stats. <laughs> they distract from the vampire. 52% <laughs> vampire. Dear God. Are we, gonna, are we gonna go? How far can we go on 52% vampire? That is a nice chunk of damage, but the vampire. <laughs> I'm, I'm literally. <laughs> More than half of me has now become vampire. <laughs> oh, I'm starting to take damage. This is not good. All right. All right. Wait, I just got an upgrade. All right. Ah, okay. This is good for fighting the Lich. Every counterattack restores 1.5 loop HP. Damage is increased by 20% of defense value. Every time I make a loop, I get more defense, which should theoretically bump this up by one. But counterattacks, I could restore. The every, huh, I'm torn. Do I go for 20% of my defense added to my attack, or 1.5 loop HP for every counterattack. Actually, we can... Well, I'm off to bed. Going fishing in the morning. Ish. They've got no counter, so bliss for a dominant mass. Ah, okay. Dominant mass it is. Again, I gotta look at my stats. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I've been playing this game for three streams now. I just now realized that this has stats. 
<laughs> oh man. <laughs> Take all my brain power. <laughs> brain power to tell those awesome stories and into <laughs> into imagine near the wiener dispensary. <laughs> All right, so you're right. Uh, uh, Counterattack <laughs> would be foolish. Uh, uh, but you take care, Ark Boba Fett. You get some rest. I hope you have fun. Uh, uh, going fishing in the morning. All right, dominant mass it is. Oh, the damage. If I can make it to the village, if I can make it to the village, I may need to bump up my attack. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. No problem, Marco, but <clears throat> I hope you've had a lot of fun. Oh, and I've been meaning to ask you too, how did the double date go with your friend <laughs> that has the Punisher Princess fishing lore? <laughs> you might have told me. I apologize if I forgot, but I've, it's been on my mind. <laughs> alright, alright. I'd still be at least 40% vampire. But I have had some pretty badass attack. How about this? Hmm. At some point, I'm going to have to upgrade that. I don't have a better shield. I drop that's a lot. And that's the only thing I have a region on, right? Mm. Correct. Alright. Hmm. Let's get risky. Maybe I can make it. Well hey look, a better shield. Point six region. I could, and I could. How much do these give me? Seventy five HP. I can get a hundred and fifty. I'm not worried about the slime, I'm worried about these damn things. You know what? I haven't been putting the lantern stone. Hmm. Let's let let's just let's let it ride. Let's let it ride! Bet it all in black. I should get a healthy chunk. Oh, I was worried over nothing. These guys are dead. Already. It was just a momentary loss of judgment. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. We're Gucci. Right back to like 90% health. <laughs> this is like this is like my new home base. As long as I can make it here, I have a chance. Alright. I was like at half health. Slightly worried. Just slightly. I do need to really upgrade my equipment though. Particularly in some order, my shield, my ring, and my sword. Oh! Vampirism? Hmm. I'd lose a regen though. But I do more damage. I'd say do it. That, that was exactly what I was thinking. Yeah, I'll do it. I gotta start hitting harder and I gotta get more defense. 
being 50% vampire. It's getting the job done, but it's it's reaching its limits. Faster attack speed means faster vamp drain. True. Now you're thinking like a vampire. We'll wait. Gotta hold out for the god rolls. I'll be right back. No problem. I'll be here. Just vampiring my way around town. Walking fast. Diddle diddle diddle. Dun dun dun. Diddle diddle diddle. Dun dun diddle diddle diddle. <laughs> Making my way downtown. <laughs> That's gotta be like the theme song for this run. Oh, alright, what's this? That is a big... Hmm... Is it worth dropping 10%? Ah, 12% vampire. Hmm. We will see. <laughs> also, more power means more drain. That's true. I want to hit fast and I want to hit hard. I'd only be dropping 10%. It'd still be like, what, 40? 6, 45% vampire, I believe? What am I? Oh no, I'd actually be 37%. That's, so, that's still really damn high. <laughs> Nothing will beat me being 52%, but... That's still really good. Uh, my magic damage will go up too. I say we do it. Oh, there we go. Region 7.8. <laughs> That's a lot. Uh, okay. Now I just gotta upgrade my ring and my shield. Maybe my armor again. <laughs> Hello, Yen boy. Welcome to the stream. How art thou this evening? <laughs> I'm very lazy right now. Oh my god, tell me about it. I'm ashamed to say that I have I missed my chance to shower today. <laughs> oh, today's your stink day. You get one a week. That's pretty good though. Using it on a Thursday. Thursday or Friday is pretty acceptable. Stink day is today! <laughs> like Spider-Man says. <laughs> Everybody gets one. <laughs> I need the weekend now. Right? I know. I know how you feel. My, like, uh, I've been completely irresponsible with my sleep schedule. Almost. <laughs> We're almost there. <clears throat> by far, somehow, by far. One more day. Right? Don't worry. We'll get there. It'll, it'll be here quicker than we can even realize. But, but how goes you? Other than you're on stink day. <laughs> Which I completely approve of. I have a brainstorming meeting tomorrow. I have no ideas to bring up. <gasps> Hence why it's not good that you're being lazy. <clears throat> well, I mean, lazy doesn't always have to be bad, but... <laughs> I know how you feel. I gotta... I gotta make some Easter egg things tomorrow. 
I have all the materials I need, but I have none of them done. <laughs> Maybe I'm lazy because I'm dreading it. Me too. There's nothing hard about painting some eggs, but I'm just like, eh, it'll, I can knock that out in like five seconds. <laughs> I'll do it at the last possible second. Which is weird because the first time I did it, uh, I did it like way ahead of time. I was like super early and I was like, that was fun. <laughs> nothing hard about Easter eggs. <laughs> I don't want to. <laughs> yep. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. So now I have to do them tomorrow. <laughs> It's either I do them tomorrow or I get in trouble. <laughs> it's the easy stuff that we put off. Oh, yeah. No, for real. I'm going to equip that. That's slightly better. Actually, that's a, a lot better. I just need a better shield. Right? Uh, 11 percent vampire don't want to lose out but yeah it's so easy it literally it'll take me like if i really take my time and I get up early i can knock it out in like 30 minutes it'll probably take like maybe i don't know that's 30 minutes for the the paint to dry and then i'll wrap them so they're safe i don't want to paint the eggs Take them where they gotta go, and then have them break, and like, oh, I did all that for nothing. <laughs> oh. He's hitting me for nearly a hundy. Skeletons, man. Who's hitting me for nearly a hundred points of damage? The game is starting to get scary, and my 14 police. And then I do something like that, and I'm like, <laughs> I got this under control. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna have to take one of these raw ass defense. Max HP. To get back to your ideas have you at least considered like I don't know I don't want to say you should steal someone's idea or anything but <laughs> have you like have you ever had one of those meetings before the meeting where your co-workers are like I don't know what I'm gonna do I'm thinking about this and technically they didn't say they were gonna do it they were just thinking of it so then you show up tomorrow and you're like, and you raise your hand up first, or they call you first, even better. And they're like, do you have anything to contribute? And you're like, yes. I say we do this, and we business hard. And then that one person looks at you, but then they're like, my idea. But now it's your idea because you said it. Like, who's going to believe them? <laughs> no, this is our first meeting. <laughs> it's new, so that's why I don't really want to come up with ideas for it. Oh, okay. Well then... I don't want to say expectations are low, but... If this is the first one and everyone's kind of like... Trying to just jive with each other... I wouldn't be surprised if... Hardly anybody actually comes with anything solid. And instead you just build together as a team. Which is what you're supposed to do anyways. That the whole thing is like, yeah, yeah, you know what we can do? We can turn Friday, ice cream day, into Friday, Sunday day. And, <laughs> furthermore, <laughs> we can we can get rid of the old fridge, get the new fridge. And then your boss is like, that's it. We're buying an ice cream machine. <laughs> and that's how you make Fridays fun. <clears throat> anyway, where was I? Oh yeah, the shield. Oh, there we go. 12% vampire. Let's do it. <laughs> I already told my boss I'm not confident in my new job yet. And I don't know how to think outside of the box yet. <laughs> that's that's how you do it. <laughs> go buy an ice cream machine. Make Fridays fun again. New fridge. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, I suggest Lazy Friday. I suggest Lazy Friday. We have average productivity, but everyone's happy. <laughs> a happy employee is a good employee. Like seat pants. Oh, I got it. Let's just not work on Friday. Work is cancelled. <clears throat> and that's how you make every weekend a three day weekend. <laughs> Sweatpants. <laughs> Stupid audience. <laughs> we want the four day work week. Damn, that's legendary. <laughs> the only the only people that are doing that are the um I believe the Swedes. Maybe also like what is it? The New Zealanders? <laughs> they're on that they're on that four hour four day a week <laughs> work style. Spain is trying out the four day work week right now. Oh yeah yeah, it's very hip in Europe. Um I know Sweden they're trying they they're doing that. They're also doing that in um Japan tried it in late 2019. I don't know what happened after that, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, COVID happened. Suggest siestas. Ooh, siesta forever. <laughs> I'm down with that. Yeah, four day work week can work. You just have to be. Company's got to be on board. Staff has to be on board. <clears throat> Sadly, I think that's too. too future esque for America, but. If you become your own, uh, you know, C, uh, uh, CCO, CEO, so many different acronyms. Your own stonk master. <laughs> I have a brilliant idea. <gasps> Excellent. Crowdsourced. We got it here first, folks. Uh -uh, but yeah, damn it. Now I'm like gonna bug me the place that also has like a four four day work week they literally pay you to not come into work and just stay home so for example I work Monday through Thursday and someone covers for me on Friday but that person works Tuesday through Friday and I cover for them on Monday boom four day work week for both of us oh my god <laughs> we've done it <laughs> and then we start doing that and you either alternate uh -uh, or just half the staff goes on that <clears throat> that that split schedule brilliant <laughs> I like it I love it we need some more of it please America <laughs> take this idea we're giving it to you uh -uh. That's pretty good, but I'm not going to take the shield. Unless we convince the fight. Alright, I'm back. At the very least, my company. Please! <laughs> yeah. Welcome back, Blushing Sunrise. We're just workshopping new ways for Yamway to get a promotion. We've we stopped worrying about doing good at the meeting. We're, we've now upgraded to getting her a promotion. <laughs> I need to be the CEO. CEO, CCO, Master of Coin, Master of Stonks. <laughs> you can be the creative fun officer. The CFO. <laughs> or you can be the uh, the MOF. The Master of Fun. The Master of Stonks. <laughs> Just by the company. Easy peasy. <laughs> she can do it if she becomes the master of stonks. The manster of stonks. Wow, I got some good jobs. Alright, I gotta look at these. <gasps> yes, sir. Bonk. That is a lot of HP. I'm just acknowledging it. Hmm. 4.8 regen. I dropped 12%. 
I would be 28% vampire. But my attack speed... <clears throat> and then I could go back to being 40% here. I just need a better weapon. I would also give myself an awesome title too. We should all give ourselves awesome titles. <clears throat> I'm for it. We have this has to be the new standard. It's out with the old standard and it's in with the new standard. I've decided to equip that. Now I just need to get Vampire back up on this. And we'll be golden. Company culture stuff is some of the most soul-sucking things to exist. Oh, it is. It's fun if you get free stuff. Our people are into it. <laughs> it is. That this is true. I can't tell you the amount of time it's like, oh, here you go, Robert. For being with the company for 25 years, we're giving you a fridge. And he's like, finally. <laughs> and then he quits the next day after he gets the fridge. I was like, I was retiring anyway. <laughs> Just, God, I don't want to cut and run. I don't want to stay another 22 years and get a, and get a, I don't know. <clears throat> we got to think, well, well, this is like future technology. I, I don't want to have the Alexa implant. <laughs> they reminded him that he's been working for 25 years and that it's time to retire. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Here's your complimentary coffin. Take care of it. It'll you'll be using it soon. <laughs> He's like, oh crap. 25 years already? Oh shit. Not 65. Damn. Ah oh, man, he missed out. Ten more years and he'd have gotten an expression. <laughs> an espresso machine. Damn, this is a long haul. <laughs> Keurig? Damn. Mr. Coffee. <laughs> Chef mate. <laughs> What's, what are the brands over there? <laughs> Some foreign brand that we don't even know of. <laughs> Damn. Ain't it the truth though. Ain't it the truth. It's now my goal. You get my fridge. Slash expression machine. I can't even say express. Expresso machine. There we go. Say it with me now. Expresso. Hmm. That attack speed is just too good. Wait, I said I don't need that. Oh no. I need this to be replaced. Damn. Hmm. What about this? Alright, good stuff, just not good enough. We're on loop 16. 28% vampirism. Yep. We used to be at an all time high, was 52%. Yeah, we had a raffle at work like three weeks after I started. I won even though I didn't even care about it, right? That's how they that's how they get you. We don't want them to revolt, so we give them free things that they don't even need or want. That's like Oprah Winfrey when she gave everyone a free car. She's like, and everyone look under your seats, you're getting a car! And then everyone was like, tears, oh my god, free car! And then she's like, but you gotta afford the insurance if you want to keep it! And everyone's like, no! I'm barely making it as it is! <laughs> and she's like, well then, I guess you gotta give me the car back! <laughs> oh, man. I love Oprah. Her and her free cars and their high car insurance costs. <laughs> Who'd have thought? Tragic! <laughs> right? But a 55 inch TV. Mm. Uh, 
that's pretty good. And then you open it and you realize it's like from 2008. So it's like one of those tube big screen TVs. <laughs> and they have to like, they pay someone to wheel it in. <laughs> oh man. Uh, office corporate culture, everyone. I think the strat with the car is just to just sell it. Take what's left after taxes. That's what some people ended up doing. Or tried to. <laughs> and then the other people. There's actually a new 4K TV. Oh! <clears throat> there you go. Sometimes life is just like, here, take this. You've earned it. Ooh, 14% vampirism. 78, defense 11. Taking it. Taking it. It's happening. I'm so close. My next goal is to break 2,000 for my HP bar. Forty-two percent vampire. We'll wait. We'll wait. <laughs> what the fuck? You want a TV? Oh man, that stuff happens. I've like, I've won a muffin or something for work. Raffles, that's it. Traded it to my friend for her 50 kiss. Why not? Gave her a newer bigger TV. We had a short bingo game and the prize was a $50 gift card. Well, that's cool. The only thing I can remember winning is because I looked homeless, I got a free Miller Jack in a Box. <laughs> True story. So, I walk into Jack in a Box and it didn't even work there. And I was with my friends, I just, I had the bad habit of looking homeless. I still look, <laughs> you look homeless! <laughs> yep. What the? <laughs> yeah. Homeless chic. <laughs> imagine, imagine, what are the guys from Home Alone? The bandits, the wet bandits, sticky bandits, the wet bandits. Is your sense of style? <laughs> yes. Oh no, it used to be. This was like high school. A long time ago, many moons ago. I just didn't care. I put anything on. Hence the homeless. It's gonna be in fashion in a few years, just you wait. Oh, I will. And once you start getting free meals, <laughs> you game the system. So I went, and I was with my friends, and we're standing in line. And mind you, I actually had money. Okay, high school understandable. Yeah, yeah. Did I tell the story again, boy, if I wore the same thing three years in a row? Have I told that story? Because <laughs> that's a great story. I Ego was a hipster before. Yeah, it was. Before it was cool. And then other people started to do it, and it was uncle. Yes, the high school. Yes, that's the story. <laughs> Didn't care. Somehow, you're on the outfit. <laughs> I also looked homeless in high school, to be honest. Oh yeah, I was hella homeless. I'm <laughs> one year, literally in fashion tech. <laughs> I sewn, I made my own pants, and I wore them. <laughs> that was like true homeless. I'm still disappointed at the lack of post-apocalyptic fashion, right? Where's, when's our leather chains and our chaps gonna get in? <laughs> Had a cop shadow me until they figured out I was a student going to the bus stop. No, resourceful. <laughs> oh, that, was, that was the best day ever. <laughs> that day I made pants and then I wore them. Oh, alien fashion, please. Oh man. Yeah, let's all be the, the fifth element. <laughs> and then we'll all scream like Chris Tucker. <laughs> I pitched fashion. Oh man. I forgot about those pants. <laughs> that was the best day. I got so many compliments. <laughs> when you're here, you go down to your waist. That too. Oh, those were the days. <laughs> Truly, yeah. That's when I dressed like the bard. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Those, them be the days. How did we get on the topic of that? <laughs> I'm sorry. I was like, I'm 42% 42 vamp 42 vampire, and then we just started getting awesome again. Walk around like a rogue. <laughs> oh, you know it. Evidently, I did end up getting a sense of style, but back then, 
Hello, rogue. Homeless chic. <laughs> oh, I remember. I was telling the story how I got the free meal. You know how cartoon characters wear the same outfit? That's you. <laughs> yeah, really? That is me. <laughs> I can. I guarantee you there's several pictures people from my family have taken of me, and I'm like, oh, I still have that shirt. I still wear that shirt. I wear that from time to time. And they're like from moons ago. <laughs> My hair is different length, but I still wear the shirt. I only, literally only this year, got rid of some shirts and stuff from high school. Damn anime character. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, man. But, yeah, okay, so let me finish my, the original anime in real life, right? I've been living it. Get on my level. Get on my level. I teach him my ways. Teach him my ways. Um, yeah, so I was in line, homeless chic, my friends went up before me, and mind you, I had money, so I was like fully prepared to buy my meal, and it wasn't even that expensive, I got like the number three. Um, oh, that's another thing, I, I used to get the, it was a running joke, I would get like the wettest chicken sandwiches from Jack in the Box. <laughs> but I didn't, it was the closest place I could walk to after school, so I was like, Fook it, so I would just eat like that. <laughs> They'd be like drenched in, I don't know, chicken sweat or whatever, basting. They would, uh, it was a thing. But, so I get in line and like I order, and I'm like, yeah, I'll have the number three chicken sweat. <laughs> drenched in chicken sweat. Seriously, for real. I, I literally yelled one day. I went, I was, I was like, God damn, man, what the hell is it with these sandwiches? Every time I get them, they're wet. <laughs> it's just like, I don't know, man. Get something else. I was like, I don't want to get something else. I just want a damn dry chicken sandwich every once in a while. <laughs> Still get only the chicken sandwich to this day. <laughs> oh, but anyway, so I order my, my thing, and I'm like... For some reason, I can't find my money and I started to panic. And like, if worse came to worse, I was like, gonna ask my friend, buy me my meal? Like, I have the money, I'll pay you. Like, I'll find it right now. So I'm like, sweating bullets. And like, the lady sees me panic and she's like, oh, oh, sorry, dog. <laughs> uh, and based on my, like, my dress of attire, she's like, oh, don't worry, sir. Did, did you forget your, your, your EBT card? I got you. So she slides her card and just uh, zeroes out the meal and I eat for free. <laughs> and my friends are like, what the fuck? <laughs> what do you mean she paid for your meal? I'm like, yeah, she gave it to me for free. <laughs> and I was like, dude, <laughs> if I were you, I should, I'd come here every day. <laughs> I'm like, no, stop making me use my superpower for evil. I can only use it like two, three times a week tops. <laughs> Gotta watch the staff rotation. I don't care if the chicken sandwich is wet. I love this chicken sandwich. Wow, they're the cheese EBT and Jack in the Box. That was just a joke. I don't know what, but she slided her card. I either she, either she, I assume she zeroed it out. Or, uh-uh. She paid for it herself. Again, this is like, the order was probably like seven bucks total. I wasn't, I wasn't hurting anyone's day. Uh -uh. But yeah, she paid for my meal and I ate. My friends couldn't believe it. And they're like, God damn it. Freaking Yako. <laughs> oh man. And then that reminds me, I should let this play, sorry. I, I get caught up in my stories. It reminds me of how we spent like half a day in Jack in a Box. I brought a TV and a game console and I just kept eating food. And refilling my soda. <laughs> that was a good day. And this was before all the hipsters would go to like Starbucks and try to write their novels. Or their screenplays. What the fuck happened to Jack in a Box? Like it's you know, yeah. I just straight up walked in with the TV, plugged it in, started playing. I kept ordering food, refilling my soda, infinite refills. And they were like, "Look at me," but they didn't say anything, and the manager didn't say anything. 
I go there often enough, so like, that sounds trashy as. <laughs> it was, but those infinite refills. And the fact that I was just there. <laughs> oh man. That was good. Mind you, I'm not talking like a flat screen TV. I'm talking like a big ass seven ton tube TV. <laughs> I'm like 2000, I don't know, 2004. <laughs> Everyone else brings their laptops to Starbucks or their books to the library. You bring your TV to Jack in the Box. <laughs> yeah, true story. <laughs> Oh, it was amazing. It was amazing just seeing the people on the side of the road watch me look this big ass TV. <laughs> it looks I would get like I just robbed someone. <laughs> Pro tip, if you want to get away with robbery, go to your nearest Jack in the Box. They ain't gonna say she. <laughs> uh, God damn it. Truly back in my limitless days. Bradley Cooper, the things I would do. <laughs> Alright. And we'll let it ride. I'm not hurting. Vampires doing work. Oh man, this game, this stream tonight, there's just something about it. Ah, uh, that was good. <laughs> Homeless chic, free meals. Uh -uh. Office culture, we got everything. And then this happened. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh no, the buff ass skeleton. Damn, he redeemed sing mode. <laughs> okay, hold on. Alright, hold on. <laughs> I haven't had one of these redeemed in a while. Uh -uh. Truly, and then this happened. Alright. I'm gonna mark that as complete. Your stretch. Sing? <laughs> oh, that's, you haven't been here, have you, Yen Boy? For karaoke or for me singing. <laughs> Granted, I haven't done it in a while, too, so... Hello, Rusty. Uh, I gotta put a timer. Let me put a timer for five minutes. I should just change it to opera mode, because that's what I do. <laughs> Alright, hold on. I think I came in one time when you were singing with no music. Oh, okay, that sounds like something I'd do. It sounds like something I did do, because you said you recalled it. <laughs> Obviously, I did. Even though I could have sworn you said, think. <laughs> Alright, hold on. Alright. Five minute timer. I'm gonna start it. Right now. And this is the sing mode. We're coming here to play the game. Fuck with the chat. Fight the slime. More vampire than vampire. Oh, you're Muslim for karaoke. Why you should have. <laughs> now, I doth have to sing. 